be making bases. What's going on YouTube? Be making basics back again with another dope video. If you're new to my channel, please go ahead and subscribe. And also, if you like the video, hit me a thumbs up. All right, let's jump into today's content. What we're going to be covering today is how to mix a trap beat in 10 minutes or less in Logic Pro 10. Now, the first thing to do when you have your beats is go ahead and um, export them as audio files. Okay, so if you have your session as MIDI files, what you would want to do is just highlight everything. Let's just pretend it's MIDI. Command A and then push Command Shift E. And what that's going to do is basically export all your files as audio. After you do that, create a new session, drag everything in, and then we're ready to go. Let's go ahead and get that timer up, and we're going to mix this beat in 10 minutes or less. All right, let's go. So um, I'm going to let y'all give, just give you a sneak peek of what the beat sounds like. If you've already been following my content, you've heard this beat in the last video, but if you're new, you know, it's going to be brand new for you. So let's check it out. So that's just a little, just give y'all a little bit of vibes on what we got going here. Now, the first thing I'm actually gonna do is go ahead and put a loop on um, like the main hook part of the of the beat, which is probably gonna be like right here. And um, I'm gonna work with the kick and everything first. So just the kick drum first, or actually the drums first. But before we do that, I want to go ahead and make sure everything's organized. So I'm going to put my kick up here, 808 here, clap here, hi-hats. Let me see if I got, okay, we got some open hats. And got this guy right here, melody, organ, synth. All right, cool. Now that we have everything organized, I'm going to go ahead and solo out everything else except for this kick. I'm going to just work on making sure that kick is knocking. All right, this, the kick sounds good, but I'm going to go ahead and, um, you know, put this smack attack on it just to make it pop out just a little bit better. And then another thing I'll go ahead and put on this kick is another plug-in from Waves, which is this Ultra Maximizer. And I'm just going to turn that ceiling down to, like, negative... 1.0 and turn that threshold down. Let's check this out. That's with everything on. This is what is out. All right, cool. So we got the kick going. Now let's go ahead and add that clap. Cool. After we got that, Next thing I'm gonna do is go ahead and bring in like your 808 and just kind of bring it maybe like halfway in there, just kind of see how it sounds and then you can just push it up or down. After that, we're gonna go ahead and level out those hi-hats. Hit those kind of low in the mix, but you know, still where you can hear them. We'll go ahead and take out some of the lows on this open too. And 
And then from there, I'm gonna go ahead and bring in the melody. Okay, cool. From there, I'm gonna go ahead and put this bell sound in the mix. Cool. I'm gonna listen to it in some other places here. Let's want to put that um, MV2 plug in on the main melody part. Uh, let me find this other melody here. Where is yeah? Let me put this on here. Let's mix this one in. Cool, so now that we got that, we can pretty much add maybe a few things, like maybe it's a little bit of reverb on certain things. Let's just listen to the beats though. Yeah, let's put a little reverb on this little synth part. Take out some of the lows on that. And I'm gonna be using Valhalla Room. Pretty much that's the, the just of it, man. And after that, you just want to go ahead and go to your, your stereo out and put like an adaptive limiter um, on it just to make sure it's not clipping. I'm always going to take it like down to like negative 0 0.5 dB and then you can, you know, play around with the gain here.
And that's pretty much it, man. There's some basics on how to mix your beats, um, specifically a trap beat in 10 minutes or less. Appreciate y'all watching. Until the next one, we out.